Hey there, well, welcome on to another video here with Ginger Jefferson. How you doing? Hope you're well. So, I was completely unaware that this arcade machine, not just my personal one, but everyone in the game, will give you this trophy reward directly next to me. I was completely unaware of this uh, until Hidden Shadow Reaper actually showed me, and I was just like, how did you get that? He's like, hey dude, you just got to beat the score in the Heavy Chapel machine. I was like, wait, what? So I went on a bit of a mission. So, there's several arcade machines in the world of... Alia, so the first one I'm here going to show you is the one located in Zeki's house. This is accessible to everybody, I don't think many people are actually aware that it's even there. So I'm also going to show you all the different entrances now to the underground market, for those who don't know them, and for those who do. So you've got the, the one down here, underneath the Remembrance Garden. You have to go through the sewer entrance. And this will take you into the underground market, and this is where you all spawn. For those who have now completed Ref's level 3 quest, or in the process of getting close, this is also another entrance. So once you receive Ref's level 3 quest, what you want to do, you will come down here and you'll have to speak to him as part of the quest. If you haven't done it, this is going to be a little bit of a spoiler for you. So this is Ref's storeroom. Before the most recent update to this video that was being made, you, this door led to nowhere. Now it leads to the underground market. So now you can also go through Zeki's store upon completing uh, multiple quests from him. It'll prompt you for this, but once you have done it, you can come down through the back of his shop, go through the bookcase. Upon entering, you'll come into the underground market like you have done in every other way, but this is a different spawn location. You can buy paintings, you can buy rugs, and you can also buy bathtubs. These are the only places you can buy them, same as Raise Against the Arcade Machine. Also known as Full Metal Chopper. Or heavy metal chopper. But if you don't have that 60,000 gold, do not stress. There are four other machines down here. You can try your luck and still win that grand prize. So upon trying it at a friend's place here, we went for it. I was like, okay, I'm going to do it. First attempt, record it, let's go. It's not as easy as it looks. Okay, W to jump. Down to slide. Space to shoot. Sounds simple enough, right? You also got like various creatures to destroy while you're trying to complete this. So you know you gotta time your jumps perfectly. You gotta make sure you don't walk into them. And so on and so forth. I myself here got a little bit too greedy. Well, ah, I can get this and not paying attention properly, I lost. But after lots and lots and lots of attempts, I managed to do it. I got a grand total score of 117. If you are watching this video, do comment your high scores. I'd love to know what they are. I've seen some crazy ones out there. And I wish you the best of luck in trying to do this. But don't worry. So once you've done this now, what you need to do, you need to go and find yourself Hassan. So for Hassan, for me, he was in Kilmer. And I went on down here and I spoke to him. So you get like a quest prompt, as you can see here with the arrow icon. Saying, Lone Wolf has been pawned. So I was like, okay, cool. So let's see what it says, like being a part of like this hidden quest. So upon clicking it, he turns and says, Look like you beat my score. Congrats on wasting your time on such silly things. I guess I should give you this as it arrived on my doorstep the morning after I played. I was going to melt it down for gold balance. anyways. So he gives you the trophy. The heavy metal chopper trophy. Which you can actually display in your own home. Like I have. So at my home at the very beginning of the video as you would have seen. I have it displayed next to my arcade machine. So for all of those who enjoyed this video, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know your high scores. I'd love to know. And for all those who enjoyed this, thank you so much. I do stream on Twitch very regularly. And once again, thank you ever so much for your time. Hope to catch you all again soon.